All right, so we're rocketing to the surface. Let's get the fuck out of here. Loading. A nice loading screen while I rocket to the surface. Here it comes. Uh, fucking brutes. Wait, man, stay in there. Use the weapons on those assholes. That was a bad idea. <laughs> Creatures, created the Reapers, are gonna join us in a fight. Shepard back! Cortana status! Start sucking his cock, and I'll start putting my titties in his mouth. I've got Ann Bryson on the con. All right, so okay. <laughs> put her through. Commander. You feeling better? Yes, thank you. I'm doing fine. What happened? We found it, Ann. We found Leviathan. Some fucked up shit. Was it? Say, it's hard to say. I don't know. But we proved it can't hide anymore. That it's a part of this war, just like us. Sounds like an amazing story. One for the history books. Well, I look forward to hearing all about it. My father would appreciate this, knowing the truth is out there. In the meantime, Admiral Hackett has asked me to join his scientific team. Uh -huh. We all have a part to play. I should get to it. Take care, Ann. And thanks for all your help. Shepard up. All right, under pressure. That was the final achievement. Yep, uncover an ancient secret. So I'm probably going to get a bunch of new war assets out of this DLC. At least I would assume. Commander, I finished reading your report. Yep. The Alliance wanted more intelligence on the Reapers. I'd say we got it. Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. Huh. Whatever else it means, it tells me the Reapers had a beginning. And maybe now we'll provide them with an end. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. So go out there and make it happen. This is a big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out. Alright, so, now Council races Leviathan and Codex has been updated. Dominate Unlocked, available in the medical bag. War Asset Acquired, Dr. Am Bryson. And Leviathan Enthrallment Team. Let's see how much they, how significant it is to add, to add them to us. 
Wow, we were at 2,700. We're now at 3,126 effective military strength. So that was a pretty big boost. Yeah, they are. They're 400. A mixed species team of special operations soldiers have volunteered to co covertly deliver Leviathan artifacts behind enemy lines. These attacks aim to take Reaper culture or Reaper to make Reaper creatures thralls of the Leviathans. On a small scale, this could cause a chaos and disruption. On a large scale, and if given enough time, it could form an army of Reaper creatures dedicated to exterminating their own kind. The team's major limiting factors are the small number of artifacts and the reluctance of Alliance commanders to operate openly with such a pole weapon for fear the Reapers might develop a countermeasure. Ah, and she's ranked uh, as a 20. Dr. Ann Bryson has survived her ideal with Leviathan Artifact <clears throat> and retains most of her mental faculties. Her research into Paleo technology could be useful in understanding the protein device and the laws of high energy physics that the Reapers seem to ignore. Now, in addition to that, before we complete this, let's head to the med bay and see what this new dominance ability is. I'm curious to see what that is. <clears throat> a brand new ability I've unlocked. Maybe it means you can actually mind control a certain enemy on the field. And uh, then they do what you tell them. That would be cool. Mind control a banshee or some shit. Alright, let's head down there. It's the medical. Yep. from Agent Detrace yet? She has not reported in for over eight hours, Doctor. She was stationed on Valchir when uh, the Reapers invaded. Uh. I think we can assume what happened. Inform Agent Calamus uh. he's now in charge of reporting Reaper activity past the lowest relay. That sounds like it sucks. Someone got killed. All right, until terminal. Nothing? I thought there was an ability I could unlock. Imagine talking to something so huge, so alien. I hope it helps against the Reapers. Well, that's right. It's a med bag. I gotta talk to Dr. Chakwas, not Liara's oh, office. Oh, that was the wrong room. Oops. Commander. Alright, where is it? Here it is. Dominate. Disrupt the synaptic harmonics of an organic brain so it can't differentiate between friend and foe. A single affected target will fight on your side for a short time. Targets grow resistant to the power over time. So, right now I have warp ammo equipped, but this will basically allow me to mind control any opponent on the field for a short period of time. That's pretty interesting. Okay. Interesting new ability. All right, so now to end the DLC, since we're here, let's talk to Garrus and see what he has to say about the whole situation. He always has some funny insight or quip. There he is. Any word from your family? They made it off Palavin. It was tied. But they're okay. Oh, wow. We'll take every scrap of good news we can get. I wish I had more, though. Why? I just had to make a tough call with the Primarch. Hmm. He said our fleets are being decimated, so I advised him to cease all offensive operations against the Reapers. A full retreat? The only way to save Palavin now is to hold our ships back for the Crucible. But if I'm wrong, then a lot of other Turian families won't be as lucky as mine. That's a hell of a gamble. No other options? If there are, 
I can't see them. Huh. It all comes down to the crucible now. And ruthless calculus. <sighs> How are you holding up, Shepard? This all has to be taking a toll. There's only so much fight in a person. Only so much death you can take before... Before your friend picks you up, dusts you off, and tells you you're the best damn soldier he's ever met. <laughs> we'll get through this. I told you he'd have some cool positive stuff do. to say. That was cool. Shepard, I looked over your mission report. Gotta say, it feels like we've been after these Reapers forever. From Sovereign to Leviathan, they've huh. been a pain in the ass the whole time. But at least we're starting to see the big picture. Never really thought we'd get any answers. Doesn't change much. But it does make this war feel a whole lot bigger. Huh, interesting. And I also unlocked his ability, Proximity Mine, which I never unlocked during my normal playthrough. Alright, so that concludes the Mass Effect 3 Leviathan DLC. Pretty interesting. I'm wondering if they're going to have future story-based DLCs like this, or if pretty much everything's going to be multiplayer from now on, but I really enjoyed it. I thought it was unique. It was pretty interesting to be uncovering the past story of Leviathan and the creatures that existed before everything else. Pretty neat, adding to the overall story of the Mass Effect universe, and uh, I had a lot of fun with it. I thought it was worth it, so... Thanks for tuning in, and uh, if there is future Mass Effect 3 DLCs, uh, I'll be doing those as well, so tune in.